My mind is blown right now. Holy <laughs> babe, this is so good. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> What are you doing, Michelle? Sanitizing everything because ish is dirty. had to stress out because of James. We ran and sprinted our ass off because we almost missed our connected flight to Osaka and the sweat tells it all. Got off the airport. We are getting on to the Anamba train right now uh, as we speak. This is the train. Oh, the, the bus, sorry. And it's a limousine bus that just takes us straight to uh, the station. So there we get to that. Dropped off our stuff at the hotel. Uh, I'm pretty hungry, but it's pretty late. About I 11 o'clock. I am starving. I'm so so I think the only place that's open right now are ramen shops. So we're gonna try Ichiran Ramen, which we heard is really good. Um, sushi. Uh, right? No, Ichiran Ramen. Oh. Sorry. Well, I'm gonna find sushi. <laughs> and we're here. Let's go. <laughs> Thank you. 
But you gotta order the eggs separately, and you peel it first here, more boiled. Let's see how it looks. Oh, pretty gooey. That looks real good. Try just the yolk. What you'd imagine a really good soft boiled egg to be Japanese soft boiled egg and it's just um it's really creamy. It doesn't just taste like yolk, like I feel like there's some sort I think maybe it was really rich. Yeah, it's rich and it's it's perfect. It's like the perfect balance of not too runny, um, a lot of flavor. Oh man, that was so good. That was really good. That was like the perfect thing after a long flight. Long flight, um, yeah. Gave, gave us the energy that we needed. <laughs> um, yeah, I think it was, it was, I think because you come to Japan and especially if you're a foodie and you love ramen and love all the, the foods of Japan, you have high expectations for what, um, you know, what it is. And I think it's definitely met our expectations. The experience itself is worth coming for. Like the fact that you, you're in your own booth contemplating life and you know, if you want a second bowl or not, like that's that's the kind no of one experience. Will know, yeah. No one know. <laughs> that's the kind of experience you need. Um, yeah, and you just it's it's really good. Everything about it. The, the price is not even bad at all. It's like ten bucks Canadian, yeah. uh, which equals out to about the same uh, amount of what you'd get in Canada for a bowl of ramen, and this obviously beats it. So, highly recommend. What Michelle just found. I've been waiting for this moment for a very long time too. I've seen so many videos. It's kind of pricey for uh, how much? Three, three. It's two twenty. But I mean, that's not bad. Look at this. Though. Wow. The rice is so soft and um, very delicate. Like, this is the best omnigiri I've had ever. Like, I've never had like so soft. And it's just salty. Like, it's salty enough, but it's like amazing quality. For a convenience store, it's crazy. This is crazy. My mind is blown right now. Holy babe, this is so good. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Mind you, I just had ramen and fucking taffy up here. This is amazing. I can have another one. This is so good. Oh, you have to try this. It's so bomb. Oh, this is so good. I need this for breakfast. And look, I'm gonna pack it on the train. <laughs>